see too much. <laughs> I mean, also, I did have some extra stuff for a drinking game. When something bad happens, I'll take a shot. Oh, man. All right, everyone. So oh, fun. Yeah. here we are at the long-awaited FE7 PME. I am so excited. And if you guys already couldn't tell, Zevin Cornstore here because, well... We're the other lords. Yeah. <laughs> Zevin we Corn were going to do Lin no, mode, but then again, he had to shaft it. We're the other lords. <laughs> He wanted to show himself off even more, Radrex, that, that that egotistical whore that he is. It's not only that, it's that Lin mode doesn't work well with hacking. It It's not good with hacking. That's all I can say. Yeah, if Laser can do it, you can too. <laughs> well, I can. I, I'm not that. I'm good at hacking, not that good, though. So, yeah, let's see. We're, gonna, we're of course, going to do corn smut. No, I'm just kidding. We. And that, we're, this is the mode. So yeah, I have hard mode bonuses on Ellie Wood's hard mode, and growth rates have been increased by 30%, and everything has been modified in every any shape or form, and I'm going to have a link to all the changes in the description at the end of this video. So yeah, let's just do this. Ellie Wood hard mode, or Madison hard mode, I should say. Madison's journey. We're going to create a new tactician, of course. You need to name him Bitch. <laughs> His nope. name needs to be bitch. No, I already. My have... name is. No, I already have the bitch. Best... <laughs> I have the. I have the best name for this guy, the master tactician himself, of course. Oh, <laughs> motherfucker! We do not want to have this conversation at the beginning of this goddamn hack. <laughs> All right, let me see. What is the fire affinity again? Because I'm. I think it's May. There's a May and there's a June. I think. Let me see. No, it's that's... sometime in the summer. That's when. Nope. Try oh. June and July. There yeah, wow, the hottest month of the year normally on our hemisphere happens <laughs> the fire affinity. Wait, oh, so, oh, September is also. And I'll go with July. July. Well, yeah, because when you're stuck in September, when school starts, yes. your whole life is gonna be on fire. Hmm, Wake me up when Wake me September up, ends. Oh, I thought. Okay, I, I was so going for the things. whole other fucking route with that. <laughs> Jesus, man, we're right. off like sync tonight. Once dragon fud <laughs> man in a war called the falling. Oh wait, wrong game. <laughs> Well, yeah, we already know how the, what goes yes, on here. Yes, but yeah, this, do we want to do this? Yes, this is going to okay, be. Okay, we could just take turns then. If you All want. right, do the Bane voice for the whole thing. Mankind vanquished the dragons thanks to the efforts of eight heroes. Okay, we're gonna skip this part because we already know how this goes. <laughs> Man, I was excited to do my Bane voice. Damn it! Sorry, you can do the Nurgle. Bane I am CIA. Get into the plane. <laughs> hey, Nurgle isn't in this game. Spencer, however, is. Right. I love how me and Quirks were like on page with the fucking Bane voice. All right, so <laughs> deep within the Lycian League lies Foray, a land that has known no comfort for many generations, but which now finds itself touched by a shadow of unease. Wait, what about the whole uh, Lundgren thing? Was that not considered a conflict? <laughs> Technically, that, that wasn't in Foray. No, no, that was. Oh, well, Foray. Okay, I thought it was talking about Lycia. I guess I'm not good at reading today. Yeah. Well, I well then again, I did kind of cheat earlier today and decided to take a few shots beforehand. <laughs> its beloved and benevolent ruler, Lord James, has mysteriously vanished, and I was able to actually edit this last second, actually. Nice! As have a number of his sworn men, loyal knights, who serve at his side. A month has passed without word from the Marquess. Rumors of his death abound. However, the Marquess' son believes his father lives. And he has vowed to find him. Marcus Ferre's son, Madison. A red-haired youth who will one day become the finest hero in all of Lycia. Just a second, I got something for that. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a good answer. His long <laughs> journey begins here. <laughs> You sounded so disappointed, man. <laughs> well, because you know what we're gonna do. This is gonna. No, be... we're we're here for the trolls, dude. Chapter, That's all we do. Chapter life. eleven, be... Madison's journey. Well, this playthrough is literally just gonna be a giant. Literally, all the memes are here, and we. <laughs> all the <laughs> fucking oh, trolls. Leave on your wordy. Eh? <laughs> I see. Thank you, Curtis. <laughs> oh, thank you for noticing me. Uh, mother, it's time for us to go. Madison, promise. Daddy, oh, oh, you have to give her like her mom, your mom's voice. No. Thankfully, I know she has a very New York Madison, accent. Madison, promise that you will return to me safely. So, right. There we go. There we go. Five out <laughs> oh, of five. Oh shit! Are you serious? Damn yes. it! All right. I'm worried about your father, but 
If anything were to happen to you, my heart cannot bear that sorrow. I know, Mother. Please do not worry. Father is alive. I know it. I vow that I will find him and return him to your side. I have your word, then. Yes, of course. Uh, Asuna, I entrust my mother to you in my absence. Yes, my lord, I will guard over her well. Mother, I will return. Rest easy. Yo, it's hard to, like, purposely do a fucking nasally voice. Holy <laughs> shit. Well, Curtis, it looks <laughs> like it's just the two of us. Oh, and that's so, my lord. My bitch, Parker, will be traveling with us, too. <laughs> Parker. <laughs> Parker, your trainee mage? That's reassuring. Oh, well, I sent my head to that village over there, eh? <laughs> he helps us take out a few able men who are skilled at arms to help us out, you know. Seb, you gotta watch our, you gotta watch the playthrough of Order of the Crimson Arm with me and Quartz, because <laughs> this voice I've is... I actually haven't. I think I watched the first two or three episodes. <laughs> the, the episode, I swear, when he does the curse voice, it's amazing. <laughs> Pretty much every time I do it, he finds it great. It's amazing. I, I could just be saying poppity pop 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 with the Curtis voice, and he will laugh. <laughs> I, I just love it. The Canadian accent's on point. Normally, I wouldn't venture forth without a large company, you know, but I, uh, I bow to your wheel on this matter here, Lord Amazing. I'm sorry, Curtis, but I would rather not deprive my mother of even a single guard. The best knights in the realm disappear with my father. If anything were to happen to my mother while I am gone, I... I understand, my lord, but if they're the best, why am I still here? <laughs> What's keeping Parker, eh? All right. Parker, get your fat ass over here. We've all heard that the Knights of Freya have vanished, right? Wait, well, your misfortune is my good luck. I have an announcement to make. As of now, the village is mine. Gronzi is your new liege. Now bring every last piece of gold down to the smallest fleck. All right. Unfortunately, they were at a, the villages next to a silver mine, so he never got the gold. Lord, <laughs> Lord Madison, C Commander Barkus, I... Oh, damn it, I forgot to change that part again. Oh, Marker. Oh, uh, Barker, calm yourself, eh? You're making Madison look like a ventriloquist. Mage must be in control at all times, you know? The village is under attack. It's bandits. What? Bandits here, eh? Are you sure, Parker? This girl has more detail. Damn it, that's supposed to be a guy. But, guess who is here? It is the one and only Saber. Seb, what do you all think? Right. About Seb, all right, you I'll do it. Wait. <laughs> What do you think of my saber portrait, by the way? It's not. I my, really like it. It's not mine, but I have to give credit to the to um the maker called Calvin. He drew the saber portrait and one other portrait that we'll get into later. Anyway. Nice, my lord Madison. I'm the son of the village magistrate. My name's Saber. The bandits came without warning. They're stealing everything. I beg of you, please help us. I see. Curtis Parker, we must save the village. Yes, my lord. Saber, stay here and keep out of sight. Bitch, please. If it please you, my lord, I'd rather fight. I hunt almost every day, and I have skill with this sword. Is that so? <laughs> Very well, but be careful. <laughs> yes, my lord. <laughs> lord Madison, one more thing. There is another in the village who has offered to help. A traveling tactician who was staying at the inn. A tactician? Yes, my lord. This is Radrex. No, this is little bitch. <laughs> Red Rex. <laughs> Do you know this person, my lord? Yes, I met Red Rex for drinks in Kalen last year. A fantastic military advisor with memories. Bitch, please. <laughs> if not for Red Rex, the Marcus of Kalen and his grandson, Quartz, might not have survived Lundgren's uprising. What brings More you like to? Was the one who was fucking doing all. What brings you to Frey, my friend? Huh. Still traveling about honing your skills? Of what course. Skills you have a worthy pursuit. <laughs> Let's give thanks to Promise for our chance reunion. <laughs> we have need of your aid. Please lend us your skill. Shit, you guys are gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> We're doomed. <laughs> so, and I love how those... even you admitted you're doomed. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, so show off some of these cool weapons we got there, so, somebody. Yeah, so yeah. first, so let's start off with the best person right out of the bat. It's Curtis. He has made an entry into my PME, the biggest meme on my channel, I would think. Yep, um, just about. And he has pretty good... Next to Andre. Yeah. He's got Elfire, Nosferatu, Physic, Berserk, and he has A and Anima in Staves, and B in Light and Dark, and he has the growth rates of Kara from FE6. Which means that Curtis will basically be a must-use, because this is going to be a hard hack, just saying. 
<laughs> and I do like Curtis. Or I like his... Yeah. His, his whole character that we made for yeah, him. Right. <laughs> so next up is um, Saber. Saber. And he has his growth rates from Echoes t- plus 10% because his guiding growth rates. Oh my god. I would not give him guiding growth, growth yeah. rates. Yeah. And I gotta say, Saber's pretty good. Like 11 con, 13 speed for a level 1 mercenary. Like, b- bitch, I'll take that. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty much every character is gonna be great in this. Yeah. Then we have Parker, and Parker is a mage. And he, um, let me see, he now comes with Fire and Dire Thunder. And a yeah, quick question the Dire Thunder. What's this Parker guy from? I don't know. All I know I is. I can't remember what hack it is. Holy shit, it's been a while. And then finally, we have the best unit in the game. It is a. Bitch, mean... please! It is Madison. That ain't Quirnch, man. That ain't Quirnch. And yes, we have Madison in the game. I am in this game. I have 12 con. I have some pretty good growth rates. I'll actually pull them up right here and read them to you guys. I have. Okay. Let me see. I have 95 hit points, 75 strength, 55 skill, 65 speed, 45 defense, 35 resistance, and 45 percent luck. So the only way you're gonna make yourself good in this hack is by breaking your own character. Hey. And hey. even then, you're probably gonna get some shitty ass level ups. Oh wait. Oh my. All right. Let's look at the weapons though. And we got the rapier, which is not locked to anyone. It's now now anyone can use this basically. Vulnerate. Just like Thracia. And we got the Master Sword. It's meant for masters of this weapon, and it has the Devil Effect built into it, but it does give 16 weapon experience. And we and I just gave 20 Master Seals because I'm not gonna just, because with so many un- characters in this game, I'm not looking for specific Yeah, it's not. Lines. Yeah. But and, at the same time, let us just talk about the Devil Effect. It is probably the most accurate thing about your channel. <laughs> Meant for masters of this weapon. So right off the bat, let's do this. Master sword. Oh, here we go. Please, please, please. Yes. Damn it. My gosh, the aster sword was effective. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't you fit. Saw that. It doesn't fit completely, but you know, you get the gist of it. Oh, boo. No, I. Oh, you little bitch. They can't even reach, we was. They can't even reach me, okay? So I'm just. Then why not leave it equipped, you little whiny prick? Fine. Happy. <laughs> All right. And actually, wait. Did I change Parker's growth rates? I think his are the same. Let me just see. He takes the place of Lowen, and he uh nope. He his growth rates are changed. He has 90 hit points, 75 magic, 50 skill, 60 speed, 45 defense, 50 re- resistance, and 75 percent luck. So yeah. He's pretty good as well, and we'll talk about the other two guys when they come here. One, the, oh, and yeah, the music for every map is changed. Just saying. Come yeah, on and slam if and you want to jam. Look, look at Orcus. Can you believe it? It's just like that knight said, Lance Lord Madison. Oh yeah. So it seems. What's he doing? Hey, he's taking on those abandons, dude. Protecting innocents? That's a right lordly thing to do, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Right, Dorcas? You talk too much. The lordling needs help. <sighs> right. Leave these mountain weaklings to Madison. I'm Bartra the Brave. Oh, yeah. Bartra is ready. Yeah, so we got one good character and one bad character. Let's start with the bad one. We have Bartra comes with Iron Axe and a Poogie. D rank and axe ranks, and besides from a slight boost to his stats, he has his growth rates times two. Other, other than oh. other than that, that's basically it. You act as if that's bad. Well, I mean, like growth rates times two in a game where with something like this, eh, I don't know how good that's gonna be. But well, then, gonna be just as broken as fucking. But then we have Dorcas, who is an armor knight, and this is a reference to that armor knight conversation that he has with uh, Oswin about training to become a knight. And I gotta say, this is has to probably be a really good edit. Like, he's level three with 13 defense and 16 con. And by the way, all armor knights have eight movement, and generals have nine. By the way. Oh lord. And he comes with a steel lance and an energy ring and C rank and lances. So I gotta say, Dorcas is pretty good, and he also has a 35% increase to his defense and speed. So he's a pretty good unit. Aside from that, all of his other growth rates are the same. So let me, right. let me see. All right, come on, Bartray. And all, oh yeah, bow users, um, all bows. All bows are, have one to two rings, except for lunge bows, which are one three. 
And the boss yeah. is Gronzy, and oh, he's a berserker right off the bat. And he comes with the Zev axe and the Poogie. An axe made Fucking by- Fucking excuse you! An axe made by Zev. Deadly, bro. <laughs> oh my. Alright, so- Oh, dude. You... Uh, I can't really think of anything else to say at the moment. Why? Oh, here we go. Oh, that's probably why. Yeah. You got a sword known for thrusting to slice someone in half. How does that feel? <laughs> Alright, let me see. I want to see Curtis, Curtis flex his new mage muscles. Go, Curtis! Okay, here we go. <laughs> Boom, baby, burn! <laughs> oh my god. Alright, Dorcas, I think he can... Yeah, wow, Dork. Wow, one damage. <laughs> nice, Dorcas. Don't worry, the palette will look better when he's promoted. That's yeah. what I'm told. Yeah. All the palettes basically look better. And here's Saber. Saber's the hell was that? <laughs> when right. you get a bad level up with him. <laughs> I cannot do the gruff voice, but I will say that the guy who did the voice did a really great job. All right. All right. Like was, A plus. Is Lord James well? We've heard nothing but foul rumors hereabouts. All of her is for, worried for his well-being. We heard that Lord Madison is going to find the Marcus. This dragon shield is our village treasure. It boosts the defense. Okay, yeah, we know that. Yeah. Bah, 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 bah. Sorry, it's just that when I, you hear a conversation like that, it's just like, skip. Get to the point. <laughs> oh, that's right, in that Order of the Crimson arm, I just got a memory when that one villager <laughs> just would not stop talking about horses. <laughs> you got to that part, Zev? Yeah. <laughs> hey, nice Dorcas. God damn it, Dorcas. See, but it's weird. Oh, you didn't wait. change my portrait for the game. Or you didn't change Dorcas's, because I'm using Dorcas's, I thought. Yeah, no, we got no, two Dorcas's, are. technically. Yeah, Difference we're going to change is that, that you're going to... Well, it's kind of too late now. Well, yeah. At some point, it should be changed. We'll, we'll just get an MS Paint <clears throat> mustache and put it on him. Oh! Another crit. Why not use your fucking Master Sword, you little bitch? Yeah, yeah aren't I, you an Aster? Yeah, I don't feel like it. I'm not really uh -huh. feeling like it. I don't really feel like it, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Alright. Dire Thunder. Gotta say, Parker looks pretty good. Yeah, he's not bad. Yeah. Alright, and I should get my first level up on the next one. Bartray, I guess, can stay behind. Everyone else can move forward. I don't know why you're... <laughs> You already have Curtis break in the game. Why not just use Bartray too? Eh, <laughs> and Bartray, I don't like. I'm sorry. It's just that Bartray is a fighter. Like he, he's mainly there only for like Hector, for like Zev hard mode. <laughs> because you know, like times two. Because that's the only way you can still get Carla. And no, I am not wasting the physics stuff on that. Eh, okay. All right. Oh, well, I got something ready for when we get to the store. The store? Yeah, when you go shopping. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, a 19%, of course. Well, that's what happens when you're a master. Sometimes you let your opponent think you have right, a, they have first, a chance. First of all, here I go. All right, let's see what we get. Hit points, strength, luck. All right. Okay, <laughs> okay that was pretty <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's for my shit level up, you fucker. Okay, so I think guess we can go shopping with Dorcas, and he can get some vulnerabilities. All right. All right, and I'll have uh, Curtis flex his mage muscles. And oh wait, uh, okay, we'll go shopping on the next turn. But I want to give the fire tome over to Curtis, so that way he doesn't. So that he doesn't kill. Wait, he doesn't waste his L fire and. He th chips people. No, he's still gonna kill. Oh. Because I think he'll double this guy. Oh boy, here I go, killing people. <laughs> I'm glad I'm finally noticed. <laughs> yes, Curtis, Senpai noticed you finally. You got your long-awaited wish, okay? Happy? Or the neighbor. <laughs> okay, so let me see. Uh, Saber... Yeah, I guess Saber can get a kill. Why not? Alright, and yeah. Also, um, Parker can heal, just saying. And, Ow. and he can use light magic. He just can. Alright, let's oh. go shopping. Dang it, I don't have a merchant yet. 
No shit, Sherlock. You're my favorite customer. <laughs> More from the room. Uh, can I have a dozen red roses? But instead of red roses, we'll say it's vulneraries. Oh, hi, Madison. I didn't know it was you. <laughs> That's me. Hi, doggy. Here you go. Keep the change. <laughs> my gosh, that room. If there was a way where we could just live react to that movie, that'd be great. Oh, wow. Curtis nearly annihilates him. All right. Oh, well, you know, just making things easier. <laughs> All right, so let's Why see. is Bartray just ignored? <laughs> I honestly don't understand why you're just ignoring Bartray. Uh, don't even try. Okay, hang on. I want to give the kill to Parker. So I think if I weaken him with Curtis, and he, as long as Curtis doesn't care, what is this, a pack of children coming to play? You think you can challenge me? What? Ray and Knights? But that's impossible. Don't crit, well, Curtis. It's possible when you have Curtis. Curtis, don't crit. Okay, there yeah, we go. Want well, somebody doesn't He's want you to. Do you want me to ignore He's you? Me. Do you want to oh, ignore me? Yeah. Do you want to be ignored? And don't crit, bitch. There we go. Nice shot, Parker. Hooray. Uh, I thought my luck was finally turning around. Well, we didn't get to see the deadly Zevax, but you know what? It's probably for the best. We. It's Fucking like the master sword. You. It's like the master sword. It just. It's hey. bad things are gonna happen. That one's better than the My, other level up. That one's up. better than your level up. Yep. Because you fucking suck. Alright, so let me see. I think... Save. He fucking sucks so much that he sucking fucks. Yep, basically. Yeah, no, 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 you know what? Bartrick can actually go shopping. How's that? Um, okay. I mean, what the fuck ever, okay. Good thinking! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see. Ah, oh, you would be Lord Madison, yes? Our deepest thanks for coming to the aid of our fair village. Think nothing of it, it's a lord's duty to protect the citizens, Ray. Fuck off. But that were true, my lord. The good folk of Lost know no such protection. That Marcus, Lord Gregor, is too busy preparing for war. He ignores all complaints of bandits and thieves. Preparing for war, are you sure? I would not lie, my lord. My brother lived in Lost until a few days ago. His home was torn and he had no choice but to flee here. According to him, Laos could go to war any day now. That's all the people of Laos are talking about. Hmm. Well, when I had something in my mouth drinking. Oh, Lord <laughs> Madison. If this is true, the situation is a grave one, eh? If Marquis Laos is ready for war, he's targeting most likely another Lysian territory, eh? Perhaps this is connected to Lord James' appearance shield, you know? The father of Marcus Laos. It seems a tenacious connection, but it's a... Tenuous. Tenuous connection, but it's as good a start as any. Let us travel to Laos. We must learn more. Thank you for your guidance, Radrex. Where are you bound for next? If you have no, dis hole. If you have no destination <laughs> in mind, perhaps you could travel with us? Oh, it's just a small group with a single purpose, to find my father. I do not where our road will lead, but we would be stronger with you in our company. You would travel no, with us? Splendid. Thank Horrible you. fucking idea, Madison. Don't Th do it. I pray we give no cause to regret your decision. There's just one problem, though. He's not being paid. <laughs> Damn it! I'm doing this for free. Saber, where do you think? Story you... of his life. Saber, where do you think you're going, young man? Boy, I, I intend to accompany Lord Madison. Don't be ridiculous, boy. Lord Madison's <laughs> not going on a picnic. He's riding into danger. No shit, Sherlock. That's why I want to go. <laughs> We owe him our lives, and I'm going to fucking repay him. Not just repay, but fucking repay. <laughs> that means My sword may not be all that much, but I know I can be of service. Fine. And father, fuck you. I mean, I may meet up with Takumi somewhere. You're the magistrate. You have responsibilities. I... This is all I can offer. I need to do this. Let me go. Dear me, you're just as stubborn as your mother was. I'm not sorry. You must bow to Lord Madison's wishes on this matter. <clears throat> if he consents, you may go. Thank you, piece of Lord shit. Lord James has always been kind to us. Follow his son with a true heart, Saber. Serve Lord Madison well, as I have served his father. I will. So yeah, Takumi's in this game. Sorry, I, I We're thought... Gonna give him the Takumi voice. Yeah. You know how to do a Takumi voice, Zev? Do you know nope. about the Takumi voice? After nope. speaking, uh, okay. Well, well, you'll find out. After speaking with the village magistrate, Madison and company set their sights on Laos. 
The road from Foray to Laos passes through Santa Rus. Madison suspects his missing father must have visited Santa Rus en route to Ostia. Madison arranges to meet with Corsa's cousin to see what he can learn. <laughs> his cousin, alright then. Chapter 12, Perfect Partners. Oh, oh You didn't. I changed the chapter's name. You fucking didn't. <laughs> That's great. What? What? Oh, okay, no, sorry. What? Madison is here? Yes, he Yo. has. He has set up camp on a hill south of here. He seeks permission to enter Sancta Ruse. He seeks an audience with you. Could it be? Do you think Madison's come to ask about his father? If that's the case, I know not what to tell him. Tell him you know nothing and let him be on his way. Yet, I know young Madison well. His father, James, and I are old friends. <laughs> I'm sorry, just the idea of my cousin hanging out with your dad's a funny idea. <laughs> <laughs> I've no children of my own. Well, actually, in real life, he's got four kids, so uh, <laughs> this is historically inaccurate. Uh, well, and I've always treasured Madison. I do not believe I could look him in the eye, and uh, I could not lie to him. I could not. We have no choice, then. Let us chase the boy away. If you do not speak with him, you need tell no lies. Wait, do you mean harm Madison? Not harm. Frighten. A scratch or two will leave no scars. He will run home to Foray be done with this adventure. He is, after all, all that Foray has left. Quality voice acting right there. And then he just follow, watches okay. a marathon and of NCIS. And this... He's in such a small army. I think we should go here. And yeah. we should do that. He's speaking metric system right now. Truly so. I tell you again, I'm pleased to have you with us, Lord Hellman. He's not only my father's friend, I've known him since I was a child. I'm sure that he will help Lord us. Cousin. <laughs> what? Right. Oh, Lord Madison, beware there. Someone's coming at us with hockey pucks. I don't think that's nice. <laughs> Noble sirs, alms for a poor villager. Poor villager? You look nothing like an honest man. I mean, clear the road. Step quickly or, uh... Step quickly? <laughs> Good advice. Maybe it's you who should follow it. What? Someone wants the boy in an early grave. I shame if you ask me, but he'll die here today. Come on, boys, earn your keep. Oh no, he's scratching his play with no survivors, eh? <laughs> oh god, that's a lot of guys. And we got this covered. And Dorcas. Oh shit. Here we go again, eh, Red Rex? Don't fucking kill me this time. Seems our fates are bound. Natalie? Oh, she's so afraid. I'm working for you this time, so she's not too worried. She should be. Guide my axe, you little bitch. Damn it, it's supposed to say guide my lance, and <laughs> at the end he's supposed to say, remember, Rad Rex, trust, build an army, trust nobody, fire me. <laughs> so yeah, here's oh, the... I just realized, for that whole little glitch here, I could have just played this. I feel fine. Oh. <laughs> it's unintelligible, <laughs> just like what we saw. Uh, damn it. Alright, I guess Bartry can go and get the village. Um, let me see. Why are you- We should get the dragon shit. Well, I got- t that's a lot of tens right there, just saying. Just saying. Alright, so let's see. You had to break the game to make yourself feel good about it. I'm kind of- We should get the- Boop, 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 boop. I think Parker- Wait would... until the beginning of the next chapter. Or wait, yeah. wait until Ze- wait. wait until boop, 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 Ze- Wait, let's wait until boop, Zev and Lyoko join us. Lyco! Lyco, sorry. I actually, you never told me, you ever never actually told me how to pronounce that name, so you, you can't believe it. Lyoko? I mean, there was that show, Code Lyoko. Yeah. Well, I mean, Lyco is literally just L I K O, and it's derivative from the Greek word for wolf, so. I figured. Oh, wait, shit. I just realized that I'm an author nerd, and not a lot of people think like I do. Oops! Sorry. It's okay. We have a website where people like you can be appreciated. It's called fanfiction.net. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> hey, hey, we got some great people like Shakespeare Hemingway, who creates the greatest Garfield fan fictions ever. <laughs> like that King of Liberty one. Yeah, yeah I guess Saber King. Or Saber King. Garfield Effect Galaxy Adventure. Garfield replaces Commander Shepard in saving the galaxy in the Mass Effect <laughs> universe. And yet, it would still be a better story than Mass Effect Andromeda. <laughs> Yeah, right. that's... What? Saber. What the hell was Saber? that? 
the hell was that? <laughs> I mean, it's Brad Rex the cloud. <laughs> 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 All right, Parker and the okay. Dire Thunder. Parker. <laughs> oh. Oh shit! Never Is that mind. a crit? I wow. Well, wow. yeah. he, he redeemed himself very take quickly. Take your laugh back. Uh, yeah. Take <laughs> my laugh back. D take the Berser laugh back. Berser Don't waste a berserk. What the fuck are you doing? Berserk Don't waste berserks berserk until it is needed berserk on hard levels. Berserk. Like. Cog of Destiny? Yeah, that one. Yeah. Oh my god, the berserk staff is going to be so useful on that level. What are you doing? He wants to die. Miss. Or not. Miss. God damn it. All right. What's the point of having a dire thunder if it ain't gonna hit jack shit? See, this dude just wanted to fucking commit suicide. <laughs> See, Parker, this is how you kill something with a fire tome. Roast them alive. Hey, there we go. No damage. Oh, oh that's Madison. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, I am the luckiest guy alive. That's funny how you can be lucky in the game, but not outside of the game. <laughs> Yeah, like that time you had a lottery winning ticket, but in the end, all it did was get swiped away from you, Spencer, and he got to collect the lottery winnings. Great skill. And this is this is the plot. You had a lottery ticket, he took it, and that's what happened. Ah, he puts up a good fight for a pampered little bitch. It's up to me to finish him. Zev, what are you speaking through? Are you like speaking through like a cup or something? I'm, I'm making my voice echo with my hands. Oh, alright. I thought you were speaking like... I wanted to go like a gay Bane for him, because that's what he reminded me of. Oh. I have a good <laughs> band. I got a good... I want to voice the boss in the next chapter because of the Scottish accent. Alright. Do it. I'm gonna give him the Rorik voice. Boys, boys. Alright. How many are there? This looks... Meanwhile, thousands of miles away. Hey! What's going on over here? Looks like some rough business. You, soldier, are you just gonna stand there and watch, punk? Who, who do you think you are? This is Santa Roos. What a curse here is no affair of any foreign lordling. Bitch, say that shit again and I'm gonna fucking... I lost track. You see, the man they're attacking <laughs> happens to be a friend of mine. A friend? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh... Punk ass bitch. <laughs> Ew, that's terrible. I loathe violence. Shut the fuck up, Sarah. <laughs> Nicely uh, done, my lord. You're a fighter born. I can't condone resorting to force so quickly. Shut up, Lyco. Come, we must help that useless merc. Madison? Sounds like a convenient excuse for more violence. Fuck off, Lyco! Yes, yes, I'm coming. Matthew! Take the little bitch and find some place to hide. I'm sorry. I'm using what? the little bitch too much. With Sarah? No, I'm going with you. I said you're not. You'll just slow us down. Oh, how rude. Oswin, let's go! Damn it. Lyco, let's Lyco go! Lyco the Oswin, that's his name. <laughs> Alright, so let's talk about Zev. Here he is. Zev is a Myrmidon, and he is... Woo! Yeah, he's pretty good, and he comes with the... And he has a woe dial. Right off the bat. And, Fuck yeah. And he comes with 10 con, and I'm going to show his growth rates right now. Well, we'll see him, but they can't. So yeah, um, Zev, you have 100% hit point growth, a 60% strength growth, 70% skill and speed, 45 defense, 35 res, and 50 luck. Fuck yeah! Speedy strong motherfucking glass cannon, let's go! I mean, 100 hit points, that's not, I don't think, oh wait, we gotta also talk about Lyco. So yeah, Holy! Like, holy. He, oh, so some, some background to this, just for everyone watching. I'm writing a book, and the main two characters in my book is Lyco and Zev. So. <laughs> Zev's yeah. sworn man. So yeah, Lyco is a... Wait, is this like gonna be like Kindle book or something? <laughs> I do plan on self-publishing it at some point, but oh, yeah. it'll be a while. Oh, okay. yeah. A guy looking for a good kind, good time questions Mass and Redrick's master strategy. <laughs> Yo! Yeah. All the fucking time, because you don't have master yeah, strategy! I, I, I added that last part in last second. So yeah. It makes <laughs> sense. Lyco and then... is... Lyco is. I have no idea who Lyco is. It's Zev's, He's Zev's friend. Partner. My hmm. best. My. Yeah. So let me see. I'm pretty oh, sure. Oh, that's nice. So yeah, he's basically just a general. He still has um, Osman's original growth rates. Aside from 9 move and 16 Kai, he's basically the same. He's the Jagan of this uh, pack, basically. Besides Curtis. Yeah. Curtis. You know, Curtis is basically like an, a, a Jagan S. He's like a Goto at the beginning of the game. Yup. 
I can agree with that. But he was also like an S, seeing as how he has Karel's growth rates. Well, you yeah. got a barrel with that? No, Curtis. Curtis, I will notice you as long as you get a good level up. I've been getting better than you, eh? <laughs> oh, shit! Sounds so funny. you so you say. But watch, the master strategist will show you. I'm oh, really, I, I cannot was really wait for the hoping. fucking day that comes back. Uh, yeah! yeah! Yes! Yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> Imagine if I critted on that. that. Take that, motherfucker! Alright, come on up, Dorcas. Dorcas. <laughs> Dorcas. First, she kind of went like really quiet there for a second. Yeah, yeah you like egg. Okay, here we go. The proper music of celebration for that moment. <laughs> okay. I was gonna go with the ritual personally. But... Hey, nice. Wow, Parker, you like that speed? I can see. I wanted something that really goes with being a true family man and saying this is this is what what family is all about. Okay, uh, I'm kind of worried about Zev here because I don't think he can live all these hits. Like he can take on the bandits, but these soldiers actually have good stats because of the 30% increase in hard mode bonuses. Like, well, yeah. look on the bright side, Lyco can wipe him out. Yeah, so yeah. you know what I'm gonna do? Zev? I'm going to eat him. What the fuck? He, you You're can't. piggyback riding on Lyco. You seriously think you can live all this? Bitch, please. Like, you can. I, I mean, honestly, the, the soldiers. Oh, yeah, be... So, anyway, how's your sex night? <laughs> seriously, these soldiers would tear you to shreds, and there's four of them. Oh, what? come on. You could take two of them and half of them on. Come on, Dorcas. There we go. I think I'm definitely gonna use Dorcas. Cap? Anyways, what? And... Yo, you didn't change his palette. That looks good. And Lyco doesn't double them. See, he's literally the Jagan of this hack. I mean, Lyco doesn't double because he's carrying me. No, and he has three speed. Wait, that bitch had three speed? I'm pretty sure he has... I'm pretty sure he ha I, no, I th No, I think that was luck, but... But these yeah, soldiers, but luck. these, but these soldiers do have like better stats, and yeah. you're completely surrounded now. Oh come on, Lyco! You really need to kill that guy. No damn. Nah, like a... Let me Got see. It. Um, no, you actually have uh, 12 speed, and these soldiers have five speed. All right. Yeah. So you can't double them because, uh, well, he's carrying you. That's why. So yeah. we're just going to. Elude. In reality, it's actually like that master blaster thing from a. Beyond Thunderdome. Nope. Lyco is running around hitting stuff with his axe and whatnot, and if anyone gets close, on top of his shoulders is Zev swacking things with a really big Sephiroth like sword. Oh, right. fucking yeah. There we go. Nice. Master Sword in the building. You mean the. whatever. Master Stress 2018 right here. Hey! Hey! Oh, well, that was good. Yeah, that was better than the last one. And my weapon level increased. Oh, that's good. Now you can finally notice you, senpai. Yep, and A rank, al a ra a rank already. <laughs> he started with B. I'm not too surprised. No, it was actually C. Yeah, but it's because of the uh, Dorcas, the, the Master Sword. Dorcas, come on. I mean, well, I that's what happens when you give him a lance using. It's this early in the game. Yeah, seriously, lance users in the this early in the game are fucking trash. Because they right. struggle because of all the axes. All right. I think I'm gonna give Dorcas the kill to uh, Zangan because I do want. I do you want. Mean the gay Bane. <laughs> Gain. That guy's gay Bane. Gain. Yeah. Gain. That guy is fucking Gain. Okay, I'm not gonna berserk. I'm not gonna berserk the boss because that's just a bad. What the hell? They're all retreating to the fort. Because like... they realize that there's something better over there, and also they can heal. Hey, nice to have Dorcas. He's he can fight that mercenary. Dead, and the archer is not dead because he went into a mountain. Okay, so I think Dorcas can just sit. How does he do against Zangan actually? Uh, oh, ay ay ay. No. Oh, no. Dorcas First off, it's a lance against an axe. Why would you try? Hang on. Yeah. How do how do I do? Yeah. Uh, oh. Wow. This even this guy gives me a run for my money. Ugh. All right, I think I'm just gonna weigh on the forest. I weigh, I weigh in the bushes. All right. Yeah, have a uh, Parker go up there and have a uh, yeah Curtis to help out to help Zev out. Yeah, Zev I think needs a needs a hand or Lyoko, Lyko, Lyko, and Zev. 
Michael. Yeah, there, I saw you're in trouble there, so I'm gonna help you out faster than you can say Wayne Gretzky. <laughs> Wayne Gretzky. What? <laughs> yeah, I mean, hockey player, come on. Why yeah. the fuck do you attack him now? What the hell? Hey, I, what you doing? Dad? It, they, they're using rad rec oh, strats. What are you doing? Oh, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> because, of course, the soldier goes for uh, Curtis. Oh. Curses! What are you waiting for? Let me show you how, boys, how it's done! Yeah, okay, bro. Wow, 9 and 11. George Illum Bush! Illuminati! George Bush did 9 11! Illuminati. Jet fuel can't melt steel beams. <laughs> <laughs> Unless, of course, it's Valentine's Day and there's a jet fuel giving a Valentine card to steel beams. I'm sure it'll melt the heart there. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> well, it's timely joke. Drop. Alright. That was a damn good joke, I'm not gonna lie. No lie, no lie, no dead. lie. Okay, that guy's dead. Alright. Uh, hmm. Do it! Don't fucking risk it, I swear to god, you better- ah! ah! Well, I didn't crit, so that's good. Slow clap time. Okay. Too fast. Come on, please. Yeah, it's slow yes. clap start slow, and then it when the more people get in, it gets faster. Okay, nah, dope. slow clap happens, then everyone will pass. Are you sure? Did I, I guess I've been watching the wrong rom-coms rom then. Nice. <laughs> okay, I think Parker can get this kill now. By the um, uh, no he can't actually. Uh, <laughs> you fucking fool. <laughs> miss and miss. Okay, well. What have we learned today? Uh, Parker's gonna die. No. And here's that. No, by the way. mouth actually doesn't look that bad. I likey. I try my best. Oh my. Crit better fucking play crits. Dodge. Okay. Game main, better miss. Of course not. Okay. Well, that happened. Okay, there we go. All right, RNG repeat. All right, now I guess yeah, Parker's going up there. And so, okay, that is a total of one save state resetting. I think that's a shot, yeah, even we're... though I've been drinking while not playing oh, by the no, rules. Out, let's go. Yeah, All right. that is one reset so far. All right, three, two. Okay, I already drank before you even counted down. I'm a terrible... <laughs> I, I cheat. There we go. You fucking cheating bastard. Want to play 21? Well, I play 22. <gasps> <laughs> oh. Damn it! Ah, uh, so, so close. All right, come on, get some luck. Hit point speed, defense, resistance. Damn it, no luck. Yo, the one thing I will, I will down like a whole freaking. I'll take a goddamn Jaeger bomb. Once you crit and kill yourself with that master sword. Okay. The whole well, Jaeger bomb. I'll do it down in one go. Once you crit and kill yourself with the master sword. Do it. No, not doing it. No, I'm saying do it as in kill him. You can't even kill him. What type of master strategist are you? Oh, please. That doesn't involve master strategies. <laughs> the yes, strategy of getting rid of it. your enemy is to kill him before he kills you. Isn't that correct? No, that's what not how you play the game. Oh, wait. I Wait, are we that's playing like Smurf's Puzzle Quest or something? This doesn't look like Smurf's Puzzle Quest or something. <laughs> I'm going to need an iron sword, man. Wait, why did I buy... Okay, why am I buying bows when I don't even have a bow use? <laughs> For future use. Fuck. It's called for future use, eh? You could have just had them up close and personal instead of by the side. Eh. I mean, we're talking about Red Rex. Uh, miss. Yeah, you got a point there. Okay, and I think Curtis can get the kill. Because I do want to get Curtis some experience, because I am going to use him fully for the like entire hack, because I like him. And I also. Ah, Curtis. It's okay. Look on the bright side. You could get one later. Okay, wait. If I move him off the forts, <laughs> I'm pretty sure Zangan will go into the onto the fort to heal. Hey, nice job, Saber is even. Clean. I wouldn't take that chance. I'm pretty sure he'll retreat to the fort. 
Skill and defense. Okay, well, these are echo growth rates. Yeah, but I do not take that chance. I have a feeling he's going to go for Dorcas. Okay, now he's not going to go for Dorcas. He'll either retreat to this fort or this fort. I'm pretty sure. I'm 97 Well, either way. Ah, no. no. He went for Saber. Ah, you thought I'd go. Yes. I'm going Banzai charge on you, boy. And I forgot to move Saber. All right. Yeah, that can happen. You know what that means? Okay, I'm pretty sure... He'll go for Saber, so I'll move Curtis in. I swear to God, if he goes for me, this guy ha he's got to be retarded. Okay. There we go. Nice. He's just standing there in the trees. He's like, hey, come on over here. I want to show you something. Yo, he had to rub one off. Don't judge him. <laughs> 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 he was like, he had an itch in his shoulder. He's like, eh, just give me one second. Oh, crap. Sonia's in the army. Uh, guys, I need to be gone for about 20 minutes. <laughs> All right. Bye, bitch. Hey! Oh, hey, look at this. In the power of the month, you're dead. <laughs> oh, ah! This was not so easy as it seemed. Alright, see. Nice. Curtis got some experience. And finally. Phew! Is that all of them? Zev, where did you come from? Well met, bitch. Yes, but. What are you doing here? You wound me, you prick! How do you mean? <laughs> Look! You were looking for your father, right? Why the fuck didn't you send word? Your brother was just named Marcus Ostia. He's going to be very busy setting up his court council. Lord Uther must need your support. You are his brother, after all. Are you fucking idiot? My brother's not that weak. Oh, he did mention some things in public, but you know, that's not important. He knew exactly what I was planning and he let me go. Is that so? Well then, it would be re unwise to refuse his kindness. It does good to see you, Zeb. Thank you. Think nothing of it, bitch. You're gonna need me anyway. You know Lyco, don't you? Well met, Lord Medicine. It's good to see you again, Lyco. So, you came as well? Yes, Lord Uther was worried about Lord Zev traveling alone. I've been ordered to keep a close eye on him. <laughs> of course, good to have you with us. Lord Heck, Lord Zev, why didn't you tell me the fighting was done? I apologize for I, the interruption. I know, I have oh, them. Right. I apologize for the interruption. I couldn't restrain her any longer. Are these companions yours, Zev? Ah, uh, I guess they are. One might have hoped for better, but... That was uncalled for. I can't believe you said that. Matthew, did you hear what he said about you? Me? He was talking about you! Zev, why don't you introduce us? The noisy bitch here is Sarah. Believe it or not, she's actually a decent cleric. Yes, I am Sarah, my lord. Pleased to meet you. And that's Matthew. He does a lot of, well, sneaking around. My lord. Sneaking around? Well, I gather information, open doors, chests, and such. I've got nimble fingers. Oh, by the I'll way, here's her wallet thing. back. That sounds <laughs> like a thief's work. Bitch, don't judge me. Well, <laughs> don't let it worry you. But... Look... This journey, I suspect it might be harder than you fucking think, so we're gonna need this guy, alright? Just settle down. I just noticed that Madison is a ghost. What is it, Zev? Yep. Do you know something? Nothing specific, rumors abound, yada yada yada. League of Assassins, apparently they're making a move on Lika, who gives a fuck. Experienced bounty hunters and mercenaries are vanishing, That, rem that reminds me, when the men who attacked us said something odd. Uh, what the hell was that? Oh, Lord Madison, if I may. Curtis! Still holding Madison's hand, huh? Well, the Lord said, of course. I have to make sure he notices me somehow. <laughs> Your resistance is greatly appreciated, eh? Come now, Curtis. No need for such bullshit. Oh. Tell me what you heard. Oh, of course. Uh, the apparent leader of that gang of thugs over there uh, he indicated that someone was watching Lord Madison, eh? That someone needed him dead. Hmm. That is kind of troubling. I kind of want him dead, too. But actually... You know, a captain of the guard was watching the fight when we arrived. He was a knight of whatever the fuck, and yet he just stood there and let the lord be attacked. I think he was planning on seeing you die. I mean, I kind of was too. So, Red Rex, what do you think? I think you're a little bitch! <laughs> you might be right. <laughs> Something may have happened to Lord Hellman too. Come, we must hurry to the castle. It's Lord Cousin. Madison, who the fuck is this? This is Rad Rex. I require tactical oh, aid and search for my father, and... Oh, I see. So this is the little bitch who directed the paddle plan, huh? 
You know, Radrex, you're not very good. We have many strategists in Osha, but none as bad as you. <laughs> Madison, are you sure about this little guy? Radrex is still a master of military strategy, but <laughs> we received nothing but sound advice so far. Radrex has my trust. I think that's because of me and Quirrence in the background, but you know. Say All it, right, say I it. suppose this little bitch is, has your skills firsthand. I'm not saying it. Uh, well met, bitch. My gosh, what if we had a swear <laughs> jar? Ostia's treasure would be emptied out by that swear jar. <laughs> Hello, how are you, Brad Rex? Eh? Uh, my secrets revealed. Oh, that. Yes, it's true. My guise as a comic thief was but a ruse. I served House Ostia for some time as a spy of sorts. Surprised? Well, regardless. It looks like we'll be traveling together again. Here's to our mutual survival. That's my favorite channel. Yeah, I just, no, I, yeah, I just skipped Sarah. Madison enters Centrus, only to be attacked by a strange group. In, in a desperate moment, he is rescued by a childhood friend. Marcus Ostia's younger brother, Zeb. The assailant's leader reveals that an unknown party seeks Madison's head. I'm gay, babe! Madison Game. cannot help but think this is related to his father's disappearance. In search of more traces of his father's footsteps, Madison sets out for the castle of the Marcus of Santa Rose. Alright. All right. Chapter 13. This has to be my last one. Okay. Right. Wait, can we finish this up then? No, we're gonna yeah, finish like this, chapter, this chapter. And then after the chapter, I gotta go. Okay. Uh Oh, Master Ephidel, what is the meaning of this? Peace, Lord Helmand, whatever is wrong. You s oh wait, this is you, Corns. You said you were just going to frighten Madison. Your men almost killed him. My patience is at an end. I've decided I must tell Madison everything and apologize. You would betray us? I am tired of you and the Black Fang. Now remove yourself from my castle. Your presence pains me. Lord, Hel Lord Cousin, is there nothing I can do to change your mind? Nothing! In that case, you're no longer of any use. What? G oh, oh, Gaster Bypass. There's a castle, bitch! We have to speak I'm to sorry, Lord I Cousin. That's not gonna happen, laddie. Who are you? Oh am I? Hell, oh, boy, you'll do it better to worry about yourself. You're my worms, mate, me for much longer. Zeb. Sorry. You think that so? a dramatic effect, like a Dragon Ball. I think my sword will change your mind. Ah, the gum thinks he's a wolf. Does you're a bite much, you're a buck. Tell you what. If you'll make it to the castle alive, we'll find out, eh? Yeah. <laughs> And he's a general now. Curtis you is- You got a problem with that, you little bitch. Hey, you. you. Yeah, the noon dog. Get this right or you're gone. I know, uh, I, I know. know, I know. Oh, okay. Oh, go ahead. You got it. I just got this job. I don't want to lose it. Of course, the smart thing to do would have been not to get involved with this ugly bunch. Got to have gold if I want to eat, though. I was too picky before. If I think about the time I passed out in Galen, oh. Nothing funny about that, though, General. That man, what was his name? Matthew, I think, uh, yeah? If it hadn't been for him, I would have starved to death, you betcha. What are you mumbling about? Get over here now. Ah, oh, yes, I'm coming. Uh, at least I've got work. I mean, sure, they had me go work at Fargo, but still, it's better than working at Moorhead, eh? And, Parker, nice to be working with you, Radrex. Uh, as a journeyman knight of Ferret, I'm here to serve Lord Madison and you, Radrex. I await your command. Oh, that's a very interesting story. When I moved to San Francisco, uh, with two suitcases and... <laughs> so yeah, here's Boys. He has a Steel Lance and a Javelin. And yeah, he has some pretty scary stats, but one luck. Curtis is actually the only one in our army that can actually do reliable damage to him at this point. Oh, well, then I guess we know what we're going to be doing. Curtis. We're going to go to Canada, eh? And we also have Guy. Yeah, sure. He <laughs> is a level three. You stray from Minas Order, don't you know? He comes with like, <laughs> he comes with this killing edge and a killer lance and C rank in both weapon ranks. And let me see. He also has a fifteen percent increase to all of his growth rates. Aside from that, he's still the same. The fifteen percent actually makes his strength growth more reliable than before, because thirty percent was pretty low for him. 
Then we have... We Ma haven't talked about Matt yet. Matthew, he now has a 255% growth in speed, luck, defense, and res, which means he'll pretty much be the ultimate thief if you train him. But I got plans for someone else. All right. Then we have Sarah. Um, she now has a 100% magic growth and can use Anima at C rank. Aside from that, she's still the same. Okay. All right, so let's do this. Let me see. Dire Thunder. In dire need of Hold a solution. Up. There we go, Parker. All right, so oh, it sounds like something happened. Oh, the final round for the uh, events is coming up. Events. Oh yeah. Oh. So the yeah the for who gets a free unit. The final four like. Oh my god. The top four units: regular <laughs> Hector, Vanguard Ike, Winter Tharja, <laughs> and Axe Azura. Yeah. I saw that, I was like, oh my god, of course. I, apparently, um, Summer Corn was really close to winning, and I really wish she won, though. We all know why you really wanted it. That's for the damage for Kenya. <laughs> hey, but I have all these four, the one that sounds most interesting is the Armored Mage Tharja, so I'm going to vote for her. Uh, I already have her. Oh, what? I don't. I'm sorry, I'm not as lucky as you. Seriously, why did I make the Pookie an A-rank axe? No one has A-rank at this stage in the game. It's going to take forever to get an A-rank axe user. Ooh, ooh, hee hee, ha ha. Gee, I think Geitz is a, no, Geitz is a sniper in this hack, I think, so, no, no, uh, no, uh, Berserker Geitz for, Geats for us. Only sniper Geats. Miss, okay, oh wow, I should have actually, wow. Oh, I, th I think I just remembered something. What? Sev is currently busy and he's not here, is that correct? Did he just leave for a moment? Yeah, I think he did. I mean, okay, I, I I need to pay more attention then. Alright. <laughs> yeah. uh, he'll you... be back soon. Yeah, he said, uh, just, he said, excuse me for a second, so, you know, he'll be back soon. Yeah. All right. I think we know what's going on. Uh, can you enlighten me? <laughs> Sorry about that. Roommates needed the Wi Fi password. Alright. <laughs> did you tell him it was Ur a bitch or something? No, I should have. <laughs> damn it! Man, oh, come on, Parker. Okay, Parker's there we go. Little bitch. All right. Yo, I need to stop. I'm sorry. I'm in a mood tonight. <laughs> nice, Curtis. Man, what is with the crits? All right. So Zev, I think I guess we can give him the kill. Ouch! Fucking ouch! There we go. All right. You didn't actually get a kill last chapter, mostly because you know you were surrounded by soldiers. Who knew soldiers? Yeah. Who knew school? I we actually made soldiers scary in this game. Oh wait, let's see the soldiers now. Gee, oh my god, jeez. Thirteen defense and res. These soldiers, I, these soldiers must have packed steroids or something. <gasps> the village. Probably stuck fucking steroids up their butt. Okay, you know what, Zeb? Why? I'm sorry. <laughs> This video is brought to you by Nodos. <laughs> okay, I, okay, I guess you. Okay, I guess. Well, let's see if you can dodge these these uh, brigands. I mean, I probably. What the fuck, really? <laughs> A seven percent chance, <laughs> and it fucking hit me. Okay, you dodged that. I am disappointed in myself. <laughs> Well, then again, you're having Radrex guide you. If it was I mean, like true. me or if someone was, else, if it was me or you playing, we probably would have, you know, not had so many problems already. You know, like that. What's that word? Dodge. I think that's the word. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that word. Yeah, that thing that no one can ever do in my games for some stupid reason. I mean, it's you're the one leading. Because it. you buy Ford. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, that actually, I do have a Ford car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what good timing. Oh, yeah. good. Yeah, oh, got, sweet. I get the mine. Get time and no one gives a fuck. Drop the mine. I'm not. I hate. Why? The mine is. Watch glitch. what's gonna happen. Because of him dropping the mine, the next villager to leave that village gets stuck they're there because die. of the mine. They're gonna die. <laughs> no, this ain't no World War II style mine. They ain't even gonna die from a mine in the Middle Ages. They're just gonna get That's stuck. Damage. Oh, come on. You don't think that's gonna kill an 11 HP villager? <laughs> it's a mortally wound them. And remember, villagers are expendable in Fire Emblem, I believe. 
Oh, fuck. They count as the expendable units. Alright, so I think Zev... Yep. Can you crit? You have the woe Can I crit for one? Thank you. Alright. He was just teasing. And level up. Let's see, I bet you're gonna get level hit points and some other stuff. I think I have the solutions. Hey, that's good. Yeah. I just that want is pretty some good. strength. I wish I could've got some fucking strength, though. Jesus. Yeah, my strength is a little bit low, but I'm not gonna complain. Yeah, as long as you crit, it's like nothing even happened. Right. Yeah, basically. Right? Let's physic up, uh, Parker. There we go. If we keep that up, Curtis will probably get his first level up. This, Ooh, will, that good. this will never do. Look at the time. I must leave for Kayla Oh, wait, now. I got a better one. Right. I must leave for Kayla now, or my business will be ruined. Time is money, after all. Hurry, hurry, rush, rush, rush. Oh shit, I'm sorry. What's this? Did that man drop this? I think we got a good Merlinus voice there. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty I great. can't wait to get to that famous quote he does. You know, with Hector and Elliewood. Oh god, yes. It will fit that voice so well. Ow. It's gonna be fantastic. Okay. Yes, everything with Merlinus is gonna be great. I almost, like, almost went with the Almer voice that I did, but I thought, no. Yeah, that voice is better, actually, I gotta say. For, for Merlinus, it, it fits Merlinus better. Alright, let's... Uh... I don't think we'll get a uh, Paul Lind voice in this one. Uh, Quince? Sorry, I was just looking up my email. Hold on! You! I know you! Isn't your name Guy? Oh, it, it's, uh, is that your Matthew? What a pleasant surprise! How's your sword work coming? You are aware this isn't the best place to be catching up, don't you know? You and I, we're on opposite sides here, eh? Look over there, that's the Mississippi River, eh? <laughs> what are you saying you're going to fight me? I will, uh, I much approve. You can't beat me, don't you know? You're quite a terror guy, but there's a difference. This is playoff season. Oh no, he beat me at my own game. I can't win a playoff game. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> huh? Left stun and him, stun. Left just left stun. That's all I can say. Yes, it stunned him, and he had no choice but to join. Wait, what? Wait, what the heck? Okay, that's weird. Apparently, guy's animation isn't displaying. All right. God. And the main villain is here. Hey, what's what's up? Up? Yeah. yeah, I'm doing. Fine. Oh yes, it's everyone's favorite cameo, <laughs> next to the ramblings of my drunk cousin. Miss, dead, next turn. Bye, Zed. There we go. Hell yeah! Oh, that soldier, did he, he died standing. He didn't even know what hit him. Little bitch. All right, you push up. him over, you just like, I'm... nud. He's just still standing, but he's dead. Nice. Someone just rushes up next to him, and half of his body just falls off. Uh... Like, like, like in a Gundam show or something. Lol. All right, so I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, Everyone, I think, I think Curtis will be fine. Well, of course it's Curtis. Won't you know how it works? Let me see, Iron Lance, and uh, there we go. I'll have the Iron Lance equipped on Dorcas, and as for stat boosters, the strength room, the strength, the strength, the strength ring, I think should go to maybe Zev. I mean, he does have nice strength. I mean, I might as well take it. Yeah. All right, go Dorcas. Damn it, Dorcas, and you non-doubling piece of shit. My God, it's just like how he was in the original game. Can't double anything, except for hey! except for soldiers. Hey, the original game. Well, yeah, I can't defend him. His speed fucking sucks. All right, he's level up for this. Dorcas. He better get speed. Hit points, strength, defense. Do it again. I wasn't looking. <laughs> Okay, okay, Curtis is gonna get a level up, it seems. <gasps> Ow, okay, please. T <gasps> and oh. death! <laughs> oh. Master strategist right here. Bullshit! It, there's no strategy like in a random number luck. generator. This is all, this is all skill, no luck. Uh-huh. Yeah, about that. But, like, I don't really trust that at all. Playthroughs? And show you how much your fucking master strategy is when you're re fucking restarting every damn time. 
Okay, well, that doesn't happen. <laughs> Alright, so Matthew, get the fuck out of here. There we go. Alright. And Bartray can get a kill, I guess. There we go. Killed something. Alright, good. Alright. And then Curtis. Curtis is about to get his first level. I'm really hyped for this. Dead. I hope it's trash just to fuck with you. How can it be trash? He has Carol's growth rates. RNG will find a way to fuck you over. Okay, if you say so. Anyway, guy. There we go. It's really weird how his animations are playing. Alright. Um. Okay. Uh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, we're just gonna do this. Yo. There we go. Alright. Dead. 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 There we go. Oh, what are you doing? You're about to give Curtis a level up. Okay, you didn't double. Wow, that's weird. Alright, Curtis level up. Let's see what we got here. Two hit points, one magic, two skill, one speed, one luck, two defense, and one I was rest. really hoping it would be shit just to fuck you over. I mean, I mean, oh my god. He just got more powerful than ever. Why didn't he double that archer? 9, 13... Oh, wow. This guy actually... Wow. He... Because he didn't look... It, he didn't level speed. He had 12 speed before, so this archer <laughs> just got out of double territory. Now he is in double territory. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, I'll get the level I'll get the level up, so that way I'm level 5. Alright, level 5, Madison. Hit points, speed. Okay, what? <sighs> it seems my level ups haven't changed since, uh, you know, uh, Requiem. Ever? Fucking ever. <laughs> well, knowing our luck, they will get good do when we, you promote. Do we berserk boys? No, it's not worth it. Waste of a damn staff. Alright, fine. I'll wait. Uh, I, in the meantime, though, I think I'll have, um... Okay. Spencer, what are you doing? Not doing anything. I'm just masturbating behind your back. Basically, look, that's what it sounds like. Do you guys hear that? Look, look. Yes. <laughs> that's my professor. I love when he does that. I had a good freaking fight tonight. Oh, who'd you win? Who'd you win? Hmm? What did, how, did, how did you do? Good. Well, there you have it. He did. did you fuck go. him up. Did you fuck him up? <laughs> fuck him up. Well, yeah. Knockout or submission? Knockout or submission? Submission. Yeah. It's all good. Right. Was it the rear naked choke? Was it was it the rear naked choke? Hold up. Well, it's called a collar choke. No, I also got a couple of rear naked chokes tonight. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. Any more questions? Uh, not that I can think of at the moment. All right. And Curtis kills another bandit, apparently. There we go. Alright. So, I am i don't think anyone can kill boys regularly besides Curtis and maybe Lyco. Maybe. Alright. And dead. Okay. Alright, and I'm just going to turn off animation so that way Dorcas can... There we go. Heal up. And I will move in everyone else, so that way everyone is ready to help out. I wonder who, who I should support who with. I can't remember who Rebecca supports with. I know Will, Sane, and Lowen. Oh wait, that's right, Saber and um, Saber. No wait, Saber is. Oh wait, yeah, Parker is Lowen, so yeah, Saber and Parker support right there. The hell was that? Heal up Dorcas. What just happened? Don't worry, Dorcas is fine. I'm starting to worry about this predicament. There we go, level up. Hit points, strength. You gotta tear me apart, Lisa! Why? The fuck that? He didn't even level speed. He didn't level speed again. You gotta be. That is me. a good reaction to a bad level up. He got hit points and strength, Dorcas, right there. Yo, if I had a good reaction to a bad level up and I wasn't even paying attention, I'm fucking winning. Okay, so <laughs> I think. Park... <laughs> All right, so let's see. How does Parker do? Eh... <laughs> does he have projectiles? He has the javelin. He has the javelin. 
And oh, the Havilin. That's... Let me see. That's 21 plus 6. That's 27 minus 8 defense. 10 speed minus 11. Yeah, he's fine. Oh, that's this. You've made it this far. Oh, I paid too much for that worthless pack of cell swords. Now I'm gonna fuck you up faster than you can say Banakban. Parker. What have we learned? You really think Parker was gonna be good at that? Uh, oh wait, six speed. Oh my god, actually Parker's gonna get doubled. All right. Really? All right, Curtis, you're up. Well. Okay, here I go. I'm gonna kill the guy here. Oh, I didn't kill him. Well, at least I got my friends with me. Don't worry, don't worry, Curtis. You and I are gonna build support. I have the fire affinity, and you have the ice affinity, so we're gonna be the best of bros. Okay, right? I, you, I want you a little bit closer to me. Hold my hand. <laughs> uh, I can't believe I'm actually using Curtis in this game. <laughs> why did? You act as if that's a bad. I don't know why anyone suggested that edit. Like I was just like, okay. Well, but... because it's the best thing ever. <laughs> But it's just like I'm looking on the I'm looking on like the forum like where I posted like the PME and people are like have Curtis be Marcus and have him be a sage. I don't know about the sage part, but the Curtis definitely makes sense. I don't know why a sage though. Well, huh? because it's funny. There we go. You're fading me. But you're too late to save him. Too bad. Hey, laddie. <laughs> I'm dead now. All right, another Curtis level up. All right, Curtis, come on, let's see what you get. Two hit points, one magic, two skill, one speed, one defense, one luck, and one resistance. Oh, I'm looking good here, eh? Hey, Ziv, how am I doing? Oh, you... 22, me, 22 skill already. <laughs> notice me, Ziv. <laughs> you can notice this. Never mind, I shouldn't say that. Oh, I don't think that's the proper way of using a hockey puck there. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, so I think I'm going to build supports real quickly. And uh, okay, you're gonna have a Sarah and Lyco or whatnot. No, no, Sarah. No, let me see. Sarah's gonna be on the bench. That's her a support. Dorcas. No, basically. Dorcas can't support with anyone on my team except for Lyco. And uh, that's basically and Bartray. But seriously, uh, <laughs> anyway, um, Parker. Nope. Uh, okay, fine, I'll heal Parker. Give, I'm gonna give Curtis one more level up. Watch your fucking language there, Zub. This is a very family-friendly, appropriate environment, you piece Shut of shit. Shut your fucking whore mouth, you bastard! Jesus. Would you kindly shove it up your ass? <laughs> you bastard. Jesus Christ, you guys are on, you guys are savages tonight. <laughs> hey, hey, a little bit of intoxication makes the day all the better. Basically, at this point, shit. <laughs> Uh, unless you're from an AA meeting, then you're screwed. Okay. Oh, um, I should probably leave this call then. Oops, I'm sorry. <laughs> Please. <laughs> no. Hi, everyone. My name's Zev, and I'm an alcoholic. Hi, Zev. <laughs> no, when I saw Alcoholics Anonymous, I didn't know that this is supposed to help you with your alcoholism. I thought I, thought I, could I be just. with other people to get drunk with. Like, the fuck is this shit, man? And I even had a wrestling mask on, that way no one would know. I'm drinking <laughs> anonymously. Why are you selling what? Right? Fuck so I can buy javelins. Javelins are better. Are always the best go-to choice. You do realize javelins are fucking trash, right? Not in this house. Don't worry. About it. Everything will be all right. <laughs> At least they don't have a double effect. All right, let's seize this. Seize the opportunity. Boo, Lord Cousin. Lord Oh, is that you, Marcus? I mean, Ma Madison? Hold on, my lord. I must apologize. Your father, he, uh... Do you know something, sir? I... If I hadn't told James... about Gregor's plans, this would never have. <laughs> lord Cousin. Oda Laos. Gregor, the Marquis of Laos, knows all. Marcus Laos? No, it's Mark Key. I'm sorry, Madison. I, I can't. Hold on. Beware the Black Flame. Lord Cousin. This <laughs> <laughs> pops up. He's gone. It can't be. Lord Cousin. 
Why? Why did this happen? Blast it! What the hell's going on? We go to Laos. We must speak to the Marquis of Laos, Lord Gregor. You're right. We should kill that bitch. I'm not sure how far we can get today, but... I cannot sit still. Pardon me. What? If I may, who are you? I'm the steward of Santa Rules. With our lord gone, what are we to do? First, you give this bitch proper burial. After that, <laughs> I'm sure the Lycan Council will have a meet. Stay here and defend the castle until you hear more. I understand. Let's go. We must keep moving. Yeah. And now we seek answers for this one, too. I stopped myself. Lord Cousin, may you find <laughs> peace. Alright, yes, and we're just gonna save and just do this quickly and then we're done for the night. Yep. Okay. The, the dying words of Lord Cousin. Done, Madison, beyond belief. Gregor, the Marquis of Lancaster. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> I got I want your honest opinion. What do you think of Gregor? It's all right. <laughs> it's just a very off, un it's the good. nostrils are flaring up and down on my side. His yeah, nostrils no, that, are moving. That, the face needs work, but the rest of it's actually pretty good. Yeah, I will mean, give it a six out of ten. And like, and plus, when we actually go, when he actually talks, he's gonna be like, "Gregor, no like this," or "It's Gregor time." <laughs> Despite the pain it brings, Madison takes this newfound knowledge to heart and sets out for Laos once again. On the way to Laos, he travels to a Kalen village. Madison and his party decide to rest there for a night. Chapter 13X, the Petherin Merlinus. Blech! Dark already. We'll have to stop here for the night. We'll set out for Laos at the first sign of sunlight. Curtis, prepare the camp. Okay, my lord. So this is Kalen, eh? You think we ought to present ourselves to Lord Hawson? We're simply passing through, so I don't see the need. I am curious at how Quarns is getting along, though. Who? Marcus Kalen's grandson. Oh, him. Missing heir who dealt with the bitch last year, huh? Didn't you have something to do with that? Hmm. And the grandson? Is he a douche? <laughs> a beauty. A... He's... I don't... He's... I said douche. Excuse you. I think you must. It, I think it must be his Sakaian heritage. He's dashing. Oh my stars! I'm dashing, loving bro, you Larry, gay? my boys. What? That we don't have time to see him, lover boy. No, Chris never and I are. Of it. Ding, ding, We're ding, not. Never never minute of it. You're not. Then why are you getting so worked up? You two obviously want butts. Zev, what about you and Curtis? <laughs> yeah, you and Curtis gonna have like like seven Curtis fan fiction right here. Hell nah, you're so much fun to tease. Ah, what the fuck was that? Did you hear something? It was a scream. Someone's being attacked. Oh, can we help? Of course. Ugh, lame. Oh no, someone. <laughs> Grr, stupid old fool. He's kept us running in circles for hours. My. My valuable merchandise! What are you going to do? Hey, look at this. The old fool's wealthy. Ha ha ha. Our lucky day, eh, Puzon? So you have to make Puzon French now? <laughs> let go, let go! Will you let go? I don't know how to do a French voice. What, uh -huh. a... what a racket. Puzon, can we get rid of this simple pan? I suppose so! Oh, sorry, like that. Oh, go ahead. You get. I suppose so! There's no reason to let him live, no? Oh my! Yeah. Release him. Oh! I told you to let the man go. If you move quickly, I might let you live. <laughs> A pair of dandies like you, you know what I think. Living off your parents' names, pressing about. I despise you, I slap you in the face two times if I could. Come on, <laughs> don't hold back. We'll kill you all. In a few minutes, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you? They call you Radrex, am I right? No, they call him the little bitch. I am Merlinus, a humble and lowly merchant. I know nothing of combat. Combat. 
Whatever you pronounce it. All right, guys. So when we come back, we'll be taking on Chapter 13X to save Merlinus's life. And yeah, that's basically it. Podcast, bitch. Bye, everybody.